welcome back to the 15th anniversary long run where we're playing with Tomba 2, Secret of the Oracle. Last time, we started on the Water Temple, and um, apparently we have to wake up the Windfish. That's how Zelda works, right? <laughs> Alright, there's a couple of gems which are obviously on this layer. Let's see if I can manage to get those. Go up, please. No! There we go. Trying to get that platform as high up as possible. I got one of them. I should be able to get the other one. Didn't ring. Potentially. There we go. Can I climb this wall? I cannot. Ah! This door is locked. And I'm dead. How nice of these logs to be deadly somehow. <laughs> oh no, I just got logged. Also, hey, Zero. Burning up. J pop got sick. Is that what I'm getting? Please get out of the way, sir. Thank you. Chad isn't being captured. Well, that someone told me eventually. Someday I'll have a better system that doesn't give up uh, trying to connect to something. My efforts have been limited. Oh my goodness, can I not die to everything? That just takes me back here. I think at this point, the thing that I've been using to do for a while is what I'm going to have to do. Which is, uh, if I can find the magic wings, back to start. Thank you for the Celsius reading, J-Pop. This makes it very obvious to me that holy crap that's hot. Alright, so we're back here at the start. How about in Kelvin, just add 273.15 degrees. <laughs> just do math by then. Hey, yes indeed, that does break the uh the water plant. And a small fish. Another one. Another one. Another one. Please. There we go. I don't know why that was so hard to catch. Also, there's another flower here. My goodness, you're floaty. Actually, since I'm right near a spigot, let's get a bucket out. Pull this down. And immediately turn around and use this bucket on this flower. 
the magic flower is healthy and gives us magic bones. Check. Oh, I did have a... Uh, okay. I did have the feed for this. Good. Um, guess that's it for that. 312... Uh, 0.15. I, well, no. 0.5 yet. That, no, 0.5 is correct. What am I talking about? Also, oh no, I've been asked to do math. My my plan has backfired. I guess I can get more water. No bucket. Yeah. Might as well just get another bucket of water since I'm at it. Hey, come on. All right, the other way. There's another chest up there. Magic gauge gruel. Interesting. Another pot of life half. I think I only have the one half right now, so. And there's the other half, alright. Elf went up. Oh, uh, is there anything in this house? Can I go in this house? I cannot go in this house, okay. This is going to be important for something. I just don't know what. Or maybe I'm reading too much into it. I would like this, please. Essence for starting over here, see if anyone has some different set. Uh, they sure are, Bobcat Goldthwaite. They'd be perfect for making fried fish. Do you know what a fish drying net is? It's that thing that's hanging from the pole like a flag. First, lower the net. Next, use those fish in front of it. Finally, spread the net up above. If you let it sit for a while, you'll have some fine dried fish. I guess we specifically need the dried fish. Since the the regular fish won't do. But I think the net they're talking about is over here. This one. Can I use the fish here? Sure can. Tomorrow's going to be hotter. Yeah. And 
I see the fish up there. Did I just put one on? Yeah, I sure did. Can I put more than one? Nope, other way. Interesting that a chest just kind of appeared there. Let's see how many I can put on there. I love that it has to make the music go every single time. Okay, we can put four on there. Hang him, up to, hang him up to dry. There they all are. Uh, hanging in a row. Small ones, small ones, some are as small as they're small. Trying to figure out where exactly that uh, that chest was that kind of appeared. There it is. For magic wings, but that's fine. At least we know now. I guess I'll just leave those to dry. I don't know how how long it's going to take. Oh, there's an AP box over here. You should be able to open that now, right? Oh, a long time ago. Pot of life. Oh. All these water plants. Spoon. Hmm. Can I climb up there? you, not with this hammer. There we go. Another pot of life. Now that we've started finding them, we're finding them everywhere. Thing. Apparently not. Actually, I wonder if I can like swim in that water down there now. Well, I can definitely open this box. More pot of life. Can I swim in this? Yes, I can. The water down here is also safe. I talked to you before. I can't believe it. It was a gift. Oh, 
Ah, yes. Wrong way. Yeah, they're just everywhere now. Oh, well, just trying to get that, uh, oh, geez. Well, I like how I'm just vaulting straight over this thing. We're gonna get this gem. There we go. Open the door. You're winning, right? I often see tiny mice near Ark's house. Okay. Whatever seems small to us probably looks big to the tiny mice. That's a reasonable statement, sure. A reasonable statement for from someone who sliced up the uh, the windmill to make a staircase. <laughs> Yes, I, I have been using it the entire game. Thank you. Right, you were looking for water, weren't you? I have that now. Yo, Bucket! Hmm. Thank you. You saved me. I've got to pay you back somehow. Hmm. I've got it. I'll give you some information. It's supposed to be a secret, of course. Sure. Have you ever heard of the Tower of Courage? I've not not heard of it. Well, there was something about a legendary tower that nobody can find anymore. Uh-huh. In fact, I am on a journey looking for that very tower. There are all sorts of rumors about the fabulous treasures hidden in that tower. I don't suppose you know, like, conveniently half of the song? What do you think? Isn't it enough to stir your blood? You know the song or don't you? Wait a minute. The legendary Tower of Courage. Uh-huh. I'll find this tower and get my hands on all its treasures. Either you don't know the song, or you don't know that there is a song, or you are uh, deciding to not divulge that information so that you can get the treasure for yourself, which, yeah, perfectly fine. All right, this is where the bomb was, right? Okay. Yeah. I 
actually, I wonder if it's back on this platform. Oh my goodness, please. Uh, now that I have the grapple, I able to grapple under this. Well, maybe if I don't, you know, fall in the lava. I would not recommend falling in the lava. Four out of five dentists recommend not falling in the lava. The fifth one was fired. Well... Bye. I don't know if this is the intended way of doing this. But it got me this pot of life. Well. Got the pot of life and then died. Oh, that was the pot of greed. Actually, there was another pot of life on the other end. <laughs> I come to think of it though, how much... Hang on. Uh, show me my health bar. Yeah, I have 8 health. There is uh... I'm guessing it probably works like in the first game, where um... You can get beyond 8 health, but you need a specific item to like unlock the second part of the health bar. Also, I very much saw that blue chest. Magic Age Guru! But I still don't have anything to use uh, the Magic Age with. Maximum of eight health. Oh, hey. There we go. Juice. And I see that uh, a red chest there. I guess I could have gotten earlier. That you do not do that. Oh. oh. Ah, there it is. And another pot of life. Away I go. Okay, well we got uh, several pots of life there. No, not over the first file, please. Thank you. Uh, 
Buttons are hard. I think that's about all of the chests. I'm going to assume that there is like a better way to get that other pot of life that I haven't gotten. Especially considering the fact that it doesn't do me any good right now. I'm just gonna leave it there for now. Oh, there's a laughing door down there. So this is where we can cook food. I just need to find exactly where it was. If you meet my son somewhere, I'm yeah, I definitely know who your son is. Why is like everyone injured? <laughs> Dishes? That stuff will make you feel great, and it also has special effects. Uh, that is the hover guy, right? Thank you. Take good care of it. By the way, I heard that the Kujara at Kujara Ranch grow thickly luxurious coats when it's cold. They sure do. It's a very electrifying experience. And some would say it'll blow you away. Uh, where is... I think it's up here. This camera is awful. Oh, this is Grand's house. Hey, did you know? Rare life forms are hidden all over the place. There are people at the Kujara Ranch who like to collect such things. No kidding. Thanks for the tip, Billy West. Steal your your meat again. Hope that's fine. Also, this special lunch. Okay. Steak sandwich to cure oily smear. Cook a big piece of meat in the burning machine to make a steak. Okay. You're laughing or crying. Try boiling potatoes to make a hashed potato sandwich. Oh my goodness. So I need the dried fish in order to make the food that makes you uninvisible and give that to the guy in the pig town who is invisible. Are you Ark? My cooking is gentle on the body. Depending on what goes in, it can cure what ails the body. I said something about boiling potatoes, but like... How do we go about that exactly? Coal mine bell. People say the bell can get you back to the place where you started. 
That that wasn't the line. Can you take that again? With this bell, you will surely get back to the coal mining town. Oh, I think these got reversed slightly. Oh, looks like it's being repaired. The rails are still missing. Grand, you dropped this on your way back over here. Or maybe the offsets are wrong. Hey! Have you found the blue treasure chest? Yeah, it was over there. Um, I have an idea. Yeah, I have an idea for the uh, boiling potatoes. It definitely does not involve running into these coppers. like to get that thing please. Thank you. There's boiling water here. Can I use a potato? Yes I can. Half boiled potato. I have to do it twice. Okay. I don't know what the point of doing that twice is. It's just someone decided to be annoying, I guess. I don't think there's any other use for potatoes, so um, I'll just boil all of these. Potato. Okay, boiled potatoes have happened. Um, yeah, just for good measure, since I have an empty bucket, I may as well fill that up with some hot water. I don't know where I specifically need hot water, but, uh, if and when I do, I will have it. Okay, so now we need to get to the top of the town. And use the trolley. And yes, I realize I could be doing the fast trolley thing. I don't really feel like it today. Um. All right, so we need to use the squirrel clothes in order to not die. Also, I 
be some snow fireflies around here. Oh no. I was worried there for a second. Been over here? Oh, I think I have. I don't remember seeing this AP box. How much do I need? Half a mil? I got that. It's another pig nose pin. Hello. Oh, right. Get a snow firefly for that. We still need like eight more of them. Yeah, I forgot we were still playing hide and seek. Doesn't seem like a thing that should be in an egg. Mystery reflector. What is this? Yeah, this is not the thing that gives us all of the health. A translucent clump found inside a cuckoo egg. I see. Anything else down here? No firefly nest. Well, oh geez. Didn't think I was going to survive there, but uh, here I am. The edge of death. Who? That's not what I wanted to do. Yep. Nope. Oh my goodness. Once again. Okay. For once, I managed to not die. Wonder what happens is I die. I figured that would be the case, but I needed to know. Right, that, uh... And this stack here contains boxes. So magic juice and a special lunch. sure what the deal is with this hole. Can't seem to throw anything into it. Wait a minute. Yeah, I see you. Huh. 
So how do I declare you? Oh, I found another one. Uh, I'm trying to talk to you. Oh, I, I need to jump on you. Got it. What? I can't believe you checked here of all places. You're good. And as promised, here's a snow firefly. All right, but I still need a lot of them. I found a nest of them, and I'm not really sure what to do with it. I'm not sure what to do with you, but I have an idea. Involving this potato. Actually, it doesn't, but... I'm gonna go back out here. Note that there is a uh, chest above me. Also, this here. Twenty thousand. How much AP do I have right now? 614, 800. Okay, in order to check my hypothesis, I'm going to have to reload this zone. couple of more loading screens but I have I do have an idea there was a snowball that I kind of ended up melting not really paying much attention to it um, I'm thinking we take the snowball and kind of roll it over in the direction of the wall and hopefully it actually is able to get into that hole and flush out that remaining hide-and-seek enthusiast. You write this one. That is not the correct answer. Is. about that. Uh, you have something to say? Did you know that snow fireflies come out when you walk on the snow? In fact, I saw some snow fireflies when I was walking in Donglin Forest the other day. How did they get there, I wonder? The nests are right down here on the ranch. seen the coca danger sign? While I've never gone past it because of the dangerous coca, it has a strange smell. I guess you should read the other signs too. Probably, but uh, who has time for reading? That's for nerds. Find anything about anything out about that book? Great. Hot water. Hurry and pour it 
to the hot spring. Okay, so I did need hot water for this. Hey, hey, wait a minute. I need hot water, but you're going to get it on me. But that's the point, right? Okay, pour in the hot water. I think I'm going to freeze to death. Ah, nice and hot. I was about to catch a cold. Tiny looks so relaxed in there, Toba. Yeah, his cold gauge was almost to the top, you see. That's how it works. I'm about ready to get out. You guys ought to try it. You'll feel better afterward. <laughs> Pour in the hot water. Oh god, it burns! <laughs> See ya. Maybe we'll meet again sometime. So yeah, it, it's a lot like the uh, the healing spring in the first game. Just that we actually have to fill the, he the healing spring ourselves before it'll actually work. Can I turn off this? Yes. Okay. Okay, there's no... There was a door over here. Since I'm trying to be a little thorough. A bit thorough. Oh, some nasty little creature got me all covered with oil. But I've heard about some sort of food that can get this oil off. Right, I forgot to make the food. All right, well, we have a bunch of magic wings that we have not used yet. I tend to try to stockpile them until, um... Because, like, eventually we'll have Baron, which is just an unlimited magic wing. But also... I have 30 magic wings. I think I can spend a few. Because once I get Baron, I'm not going to need them anymore. So I think I have a mud ball. I have a mud ball, but it's not letting me. I like not pointed in the right direction. Is that what it is? Yeah, there we go. And match would resolve this issue, but also like if this guy's health bar is at one, it's going to kill him. Oh, good. I'm glad that I got. Burning machine. Oh no, it's the burning machine. Better call the burning rangers. Sure, he'll just respawn. Cooking with Tumba. Video games on the internet. Pretty sure that's illegal. I can use the banana on the burning machine. Well, if it's letting me do it. Hopefully, this doesn't like 
lock me out of anything, but also I'm not guaranteeing that I'm gonna get 100%. Baked banana. Baked banana. -na -na. So let's just keep loading these in. This music man. Cook this meat! There is a comment that I would that I kind of want to make, but also I'm avoiding making that comment. Just a minute ago, I saw a monkey in a pair of pants wandering crookedly down the street. To just approach. Oh, yeah. Can I use the water bucket on this? No? Okay. Didn't figure. I probably need to actually um, release the evil pig spell in order to get that, bo that box. Also, since I'm here, um, there's one more thing that I wanted to check. I want to check the thing about the fish again. My fish sandwich, the town fisherman, it's the Ark for Vita. Who's Ark? Anyway, hopefully the fish has dried out at this point. Dried fish. Now, is the dried fish enough or does it need to be a sandwich? I guess we'll find out. Um, let's use another magic wing and uh, get back to the Kajara Ranch. Exactly where I want it to go, actually. Oh, whatever, we'll get there. Can I jump when I'm in the uh? I was facing the wrong direction.
Uh, that's fine. I can test this theory with this boulder. Yes! Okay. 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 I understand what I need to do now. But I am going to have to reload this area again. Which I guess I didn't actually need to use the uh, magic point. <laughs> Come to think of it. Whatever. But yeah, I can actually jump and throw. And that's what you're supposed to do. I'm supposed to get into that uh, that snowball and then throw it into the hole. And then we have one hide and seek. Now part of the problem is the snowball is very fragile. But I have to do it right away. Is that what you're saying? Because like I I mashed jump there and uh, nothing happened. Okay. Yeah, I understand now. I can jump and throw, but only until until Tomba ends up at the bottom of the snowball thus pushing him into the snowball, and then I'm just kind of at the mercy of him. But I understand now exactly what I need to do. So hopefully this attempt is going to be the one. This time I just fall to my death. I guess this is probably a faster way of doing it, actually. This, this is also going to reload the area. And I don't lose any progress. supposed to be the answer. Well, I tried. Maybe that is the answer, but it's extremely finicky or something. Let's just move on for now. on for you. Isn't the big stake? Do I need to talk to you? I got the food. Not letting me use it. Banana, which has been baked. Oh, 
Well, apparently I'm missing something. Yeah, I am just... Yeah, it looks like everyone is today. Oh, I can relight those things too. Good to know. the chests on that level. And this I need to unfreeze and then I pop. Let me get a rare squid. Let's put this out. Gonna hurt a guy. In the forest, just beyond this ranch, is some strange fruit that makes you- Yes, I'm entirely aware of this. Thank you. Let's see if I can get those chests. Might work better if I were using the grapple. Gosh, I'm gonna need to use both the grapple and the uh, boomerang. And apparently, that is maximum health, uh, maximum magic. Let's see about getting these gems. And lots of AP. Yeah, I am trying to get as many gems as possible because like there is a retro achievement for getting all of them. I don't think I'm going to get all of them, but you know, I can try. Whatever analog to the mysterious mushroom there is in this game. Okay, so this is that one white chest. Which I'm not really sure unless. Hang on. Hang on. Can I push this? No. Maybe I can't push it because I'm trying to push on ice and I'm not getting any traction. No. Well, that doesn't help. I was just stuck in there forever. And by forever, I mean until we reload the level.
I'm not gonna do right now because I don't really know how I'm meant to get that. And it's still locked. Oh, I see you're done with your statue. Can we have that? <sighs> Finally, it's done. The Supreme Eye Sculpture has been completed. I know exactly where to put this. Wow, it's really beautiful. Of course it is. <laughs> this is good enough to be displayed on the world's premier pedestal. It's been a while since I felt this good about work. Yeah, it would be nice to display it on a famous pedestal somewhere. Of course, if I did that, I'd be tempting the sculptor's fate. Well, I seem to remember something like the pedestal at that temple. Temple? Pedestal? No way! The holy pedestal? The holy pedestal? <laughs> looks just like my own statue. Hey, priest, let's go put my statue on that pedestal, okay? Uh, okay, let's do it, but... Uh, that's a valid reaction. <laughs> All right, with my statue, the temple will look even better than ever. All right, bring it quick. All right, so now we just gotta bring this ice sculpture to the holy pedestal before it melts. This is ice that never melts. It's basically ice nine. Also, we have at least one or two um, rare animals to contribute to the collection here. Ah, this is a rare item indeed. You're giving it to me? Why, thank you. Ho ho! Ah, this is. There's only one left. And then we get something, presumably. Uh, how much door do I want? A cog. All right. I'll remove this one so no funny business can happen in the meantime. Yeah, I already took it out. I don't know if you noticed. <laughs> Somehow they're still alive. My three daughters seem to like you guys. Feel free to come visit any time. Alright, and that goes to the next area, which we're not going to yet. Kujara Washing Shed. This is where we wash the Kujara, who've been soiled by the Toradaka oil. What do you think? Wanna try it? Sure thing, Decker King. That valuable Kujara fur could be ruined if we never wash it. But the machine's old, and it won't run for more than 90 seconds. Try to finish in that time. All you have to do is catch the Kujara and throw them in the hole. Simple, huh? Start with the first group. These are the docile ones, so you should have no trouble. Bitten by a stray Kujara?
Oh, interesting. So if I'm not currently in control, it doesn't count the time. That's actually good. Pig bagging experience is really paying off here. Although I did have in mind to take off this squirrel suit, which uh, I can't currently do, not during the event. just because, like, it takes longer to drop, currently. Right down there. Boom! From downtown! This always happens. Wow, I, you, you might want to like All replace right. this now fuse. The next group. These guys are a lot tougher than the last group. Can I take off the suit first? No. So now we have moving targets, huh? This squirrel suit is not doing me any favors. This is kinda dumb, I'm gonna be real. Also, the fact that it just kind of arbitrarily closes there. And, yeah. Say no so that I can uh too bad. I guess it's just too hard for a novice. No, I just need to take off the suit so that I can jump normally. Anytime you want to try washing again, just come on back. 
is gonna start me from level two, right? Okay. I don't know if this is any better, actually. <laughs> I am glad at least that uh, even if these things, um, like even if I get hit, like I don't have health, it's just, it stuns me for a little bit. Ow. Oh. That would have been a cool shot to make. Okay, I need... Oh, come on now. This thing where it opens and closes, what the, like, what explanation do you have for that? I would have had to land directly on it and throw it immediately and hope that it land. Ah. <sighs> main issues is like a lot of these throws are just blind. You just gotta toss it and hope it lands. Got half of them in less than half of the time. Now four of them with still a minute left. Ah. Oh, come on! <sighs> okay, got 28 seconds for the last one. I think I can do this. Man, imagine if the time didn't stop for anything. That's it. That's it. Not pretty good. This machine is pretty worn out. Of course, 
This always happens. Yes, I understand how crappy your machine is. Maybe this group is too tough. Wanna try? Not like you're giving me a choice. Also, it's good to know that I can just instantly try. Yeah, get up the ladder. I am trying to concentrate on that one over on the right side because it's harder to get. <sighs> Time for the hard one. Well, at least land on them, Tomba. Holy crap. Okay. Not the hard one. Got that one in accidentally. <laughs> should be the last level. Hey, you're good. Watch that whole group. You're already in the same league as we are. Great. Here, this is for you. Yeah, this is for you. This is an item that we all have. We use it to clean off Toradaka oil, so take precious care of it. 
There we go. That's what I'm supposed to use, I bet. Oh dear. Look at that. It's had it. It's broken. And we've still got some Kujara left to wash. If only we had a But there's another view. level? I'm gonna guess I don't have this large fuse yet. Oh. Before I go outside, always put on your fur suit. Okay, so now that I have this oil remover, I should be able to use it on that one guy who's all oiled up. Theoretically. I think is over here. I just talk to you, or do I have to use it? I have to use it. Except, no, it's not letting me use it. What do I need to do to help you? Because I have the thing that I need to help you. Ah, whatever. I'm having as much fun as the game will allow me to have, Tyrion. Thank you, and have a good night. Now that's the washing shed. And yeah, I guess there is yet another level. Here we are back in this friggin' forest again. Magic water. Actually, I wonder if I use the swimming pig suit. Nope, that's still death water. Uh, it's in my best interest to use the squirrel bones. proper indication of like which way makes it go up and which way makes it go down. You just gotta kind of know.
part of life. So laughing door here. Everybody's favorite game. How do I get up there? platform there that I, if I can grab onto it, <sighs> and part of the problem is, is it really easy to launch myself diagonally, or to throw diagonally, rather. I get out of my face. Yep. <sighs> I don't know if this is the intended solution, but at the very least it feels doable. Like, if only barely. to get up there, but uh, my method does not appear to be the intended method. Let me see if I can get up to that laughing door despite being stuck in a laughing state. Which means that I can't use my weapon. Oh. Computer, please. appears to be yes, I can make it to the laughing door. Hello. What child? Need something? Oh, I'm a little busy right now, making some magic powder. Oh, huh? Oh, what have I done? I seem to have forgotten that ingredient. Oh, no. Alright, well, 
I managed to get up to the laughing door, but unfortunately, that is doing me no good. Actually, now that I'm invisible, I believe it was at the Ranch Summit. Okay, well, I'm going to go to the Kajara Shed and work back, work from there. Now, the, the one disadvantage is since I'm invisible, that means that by the rules of the game, I'm not allowed to wear clothes, despite the fact that I'm still wearing pants, so I guess that doesn't count. But I do remember there being a ghost panel here. just need to remember where it is. As I know that it's locked. Oh, I'm also currently in laughing state. Um, it's not gonna work out so well. Uh, No, like, the, the guide said that the boiled potato is supposed to cure laughing or crying state, but it's not letting me use it. Like, I don't know if I'm, like, missing a step or what? Maybe once I get the like I have to to get a food and then I bring it to the guy and then he's able to prepare it into like the final meal oh because I'm invisible I can't actually interact with this So I need to uninvisible, which is a bit counterintuitive. Because the whole thing is I need to be invisible. Okay, let's try this again. I'm going to start from the bottom, actually. Because I think it's closer to the bottom than it is to the top now that I think about it. Tumba isn't doing his uh, his shivering animation, so it is possible that while he's invisible, the cold actually does not affect him. I am not going to stick around for long enough to see if that's you know, up. Okay, yeah, there it is. It's a loading. <laughs> Wait, that bops me back over here? What was the point of that? Well, whatever.
we did make some amount of quantifiable progress, I guess. Yeah, we, we've cleared uh, 24 events. We've gone from... so we've found another 31. As a reminder, there are 133 asterisk events in this game, so... We're, we're, we're doing something. We're, we're going forward. I'm sure that we'll go forward even more next week. So, uh, thank y'all for watching. Thank you to uh, Zero, J-Pop, uh, Tyrion for hanging out. Uh, the next scheduled stream is going to be on Sunday at 8 p.m. or later, Atlantic uh, Daylight Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle, and Archipelago 0.5.0 just came out, which means... Um, I think there's only one game on that list that I'm kind of interested in trying. We'll see how that goes as I play ahead in time. Uh, and that takes us around week round the wheel to our next uh, long run stream next Tuesday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Daylight Time, where hopefully I have some sort of I of concrete idea of what to do next. We haven't even found a single pig door yet, so I don't know what's the deal with that. Anyway, that's it. I'm Coolio if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>